We often think of horses as feminine creatures, agile and beautiful. But they're stronger than you might think, their bite alone capable of inflicting some pretty serious damage. And the horses we're about to show you are the strongest of the strong. These are the most powerful horse breeds in the world. Number 15. Belgian Draft Horse the Belgian Draft Horse is a brutally powerful, tall breed of horse which can make the most laborious of work look like a walk in the park. Known for its hard-working and amiable personality, this special breed of horse has links going all the way back to medieval times. Just imagine the kind of timeline you would get if you logged their DNA on an Ancestry.com-like website. As far as having good genetics go, the Belgian Draft Horse has some of the best of any kind. Descended from the Flemish Flemish Great Horse, which was the medieval battle horse native to the Low Countries, this breed's tyranny and impressive capabilities have been on show and appreciated for centuries. Crossbreeding has its perks, and the Belgian Draft Horse knows this all too well. Hey, come. Thanks. The Belgians received an upgrade in their genetic armor when they were taken to the United States in 1866. This trip over to the US resulted in them being well accepted by the Americans, who wouldn't love a horse with such strength. Sadly, it continued to be outshined by the Percheron, who the Americans took more of a fancy to. But still, when there's a conversation regarding the most powerful horse breeds, the Belgian draft horse should certainly be mentioned. Like this video, smash the subscribe button and click the notification bell right now or this centipede will crawl on your face when you're sleeping. Number 14. Stallion Stallions are phenomenally powerful things, which might sound great until you mix it with a terrible temperament, then you have a real mess on your hands. This awful behavior will be even worse if you don't socialize it properly or instill a bit of discipline. Failure to do either and it'll run right over you and have the minimum amount of respect for you. If stallions are poorly handled by someone who doesn't know what they're doing, then they run the risk of having to be confined and not allowing to be kept in a natural setting as they're either dangerous for other horses to be around or similarly dangerous to be around humans. With a kick that could kill you, the last thing you want to be stuck looking after is a misbehaving and powerful stallion horse. With such power comes responsibility. And that saying is never more applicable than with the handling of a stallion. Such a task requires a few things. Self-confidence, an understanding of stallion psychology, and the unique gift of anticipating a stallion's actions before they do anything. Sprinkle on top the ability to think fast on your feet and you have a great handler. In short, this is probably not a good breed to get for a newbie unless you like learning through being thrown into the deep end. Number 13. Dutch Draft Horse When it comes to raising horses, hardly anyone does it better than the Dutch. The Netherlands is the go-to place for horses, as for centuries, this country in Europe has been the hub for the improvement of horse breeds around the world. While the first thoughts that come to mind when you think of this European nation is probably marijuana, cheese, and clogs, they're not bad at horse raising either. Their native horses are of such good quality, in fact, that they are used to improve the stature of other breeds as well as creating their own brand new ones through some clever mixing of genes through crossbreeding. An alarming amount of modern horses, which are cherished globally, have ancestry that comes straight from the genetics of Dutch horse breeds. With such a claim, it shouldn't come as a surprise that one of these breeds from the Netherlands has managed to land on our list. The Dutch Draft Horse is one of the finest horses around. With a size of 16 hands, this powerful yet well-behaved horse is a beautiful specimen of what a horse can be. Number 12. Shire Horse 
When it comes to the most powerful horse breeds out there, there are a few physical attributes which can help a horse, with having a tall frame giving one a massive advantage. The bigger the frame, the more muscle that can be piled onto the bones. So with the Shire horse being best known for its magnificent, almost whimsical appearance, and its ridiculously tall height, it shouldn't be surprising that it is also one of the strongest horse breeds about. The Shire horse breed is actually so tall that it holds records for being the tallest horse in the world. This huge size isn't only seen in its height, but also in its larger-than-life hooves and featherings on their legs. While you would expect such a thunderously tall horse to be the most arrogant and alpha one in the field, that isn't actually the case. Despite their huge size, Shire horses are typically calm, docile, and eager to please. You don't have to be a veteran horse handler to manage one of these big old softies, meaning horse lovers with barely any experience are typically fine dealing with a Shire horse. Talk about being the BFG of the horse world. Number 11. Percheron One of the most popular faces in the horsing world has to be the legendary Percheron. This mighty breed of horse is a fan favorite of Americans and even stars in Disneyland. Founded in 1827 by Jean Leblanc, the Percheron is a strong and graceful breed of horse which has a generous and diligent work ethic. With all of these characteristics being said, it can be quite easy to see why Percherons are so adored in both America and Britain alike. Said to have Arabian blood, the Percheron's might has been utilized over the years in the plowing of the fields and harvesting of crops, as well as the hauling of goods from docks to railway terminals and the pulling of heavy mail coaches and fine carriages. It sounds like exhausting work. Percherons also have the honor of taking Cinderella to the ball in Disneyland, a truly versatile horse of many talents. Number 10. Suffolk Punch Horse If you want a horse which is all about work and none of that showy stuff, then look no further than the Suffolk Punch breed. If you're also out for something on the rare side of things, then this breed well and truly ticks that box as well. Draft horses are said to have a lineage going all the way back to the great war horses of medieval times, but the Suffolk Punch was brought to life in the peaceful countryside of eastern England. Most horses nowadays have some link to performing in the show ring, which is shown through overly exaggerated movement being developed to entertain the crowd. The Suffolk Punch, on the other hand, is built with pure efficiency in mind. This can be seen in even the way it walks. The Suffolk Punch breed doesn't lift their knees awfully high like other breeds. Instead, they keep low to the floor and conserve all their energy to be focused on pulling whatever they're attached to. You would think that this well-behaved and efficient breed of horse would be popular worldwide, with there remarkably only being 51 Suffolk Punch horses currently registered in North America. Number 9. Mustang your mind might drift to the motoring world when the name Mustang is mentioned, but it is, in fact, the name of a breed of horse. Although these maned beasts are pretty fast, so you can see why Ford decided to opt for the name for their range of cars. The Mustang breed is descended from Spanish horses which were brought across the pond to America by Spanish explorers in the 16th century. While the name might sound cool, the meaning behind it is just as impactful. Derived from the Spanish word Mustango, which translates to ownerless beast or stray horse, the independent nature of the horse is hinted at from the get-go. Their free spirit reputation has even led to most people thinking that Mustangs are actually just wild horses rather than a specific breed. The Mustang is really fast, with the ability to hit 88 kilometers per hour at full gallop. Despite being a large 15 hands in size, the speed of a Mustang is comparable to a mid-sized horse breed, making its speed all the more impressive. Number 8. Arabian Horse most modern breeds of light horses can thank the Arabian horse breed for their favorable qualities. Developed in Arabia by the 7th century CE, most of the breed's history is shrouded in legend. Although, one thing's for sure, this is a great breed of horse. Number 9. 
cherished for its speed, stamina, beauty, intelligence, and gentleness, the Arabian horse is actually one of the earliest improved breeds of horse. This reliable and powerful breed has a rather unusual characteristic in the way that it only has 23 vertebrae, whereas other breeds usually have 24. How weird. Maybe that contributes to its speed. Less bone to have to carry. I'm obviously joking, but this list of missing bones doesn't stop there. The Arabian horse also has one less rib and no tail bone. The higher tail set in Arabian horses is attributed to this lack of a tailbone. The Arabians' compact and strong bones help with their strength and superior stamina, which is put on show for everyone to see at endurance riding competitions. So basically, always bet on the Arabian horse if you see one listed on the betting slip. Number 7. American Cream Draft Horse You've heard of the American Dream, now it's time for the American Cream. While there are a lot of draft horse breeds in the world, the only one developed in the United States that's still plodding around is the American Cream Draft. Originating in Iowa in the early 1900s, this rare breed has been flirting with the prospect of going extinct for quite some time now. Used for wagon and carriage rides, the American Cream Draft is a great working horse, but like many things, since the mechanism of farm work, their numbers have been in decline, with only 375 registered horses remaining in the United States. With an average size of 16 hands at the withers, and the breed's mares averaging about 1,600 to 1,800 pounds, and stallions growing to between 800 and 2,000 pounds, this mighty horse sure packs a punch. If you're looking for a helpful set of hooves to give you a powerful bit of assistance, then the American Cream is the one for you. Number 6. American Paint while some of the horses on this list have been tragically overlooked by the wider world, a breed which certainly hasn't is the paint horse breed. Tremendously popular, the rest of the horses must be at least a little bit jealous at the reach this horse has had across the world. According to the American Pain Horse Association, although I have a feeling they have the potential to be a little biased, the number of paint horses have exceeded 100,000 members and are scattered across more than 40 countries. Why are these powerful breeds so popular? Well, for starters, they have a magnificent flashy coloring which is bound to catch the eye of a buyer at the market, with the fact that they have a good temperament and versatility only adding to the reasons to get your bank card out and make the purchase. Pain horses have the great tendency to suit riders and owners of all experience levels, meaning you don't have to be a veteran of the game to take to the saddle. With the pain horses' elegance and power, they are suited for everything from equestrian sports to working to being a great general riding horse. A horse of many talents, no doubt. Number 5. Clydesdale Clydesdale horses are an absolute staple of the horsing world. Not only are they popular, iconic, and employees of Budweiser, but they're also one of the largest overall breeds in the world. With an average height of 18 hands, these hooved friends are going to require a lot of hay to keep their massive bodies ticking. With a height of 6 feet and a weight around 2,000 pounds, the Clydesdale breed are certainly no pushover. Their large stature and trademark feathering around their legs and high-stepping gait all come together to make them very recognizable and a standout when grazing in the field. You can understand why, then, Budweiser decided to include them in their horse-drawn Budweiser parade. With an easy-going nature and gentle approach, who wouldn't want these fine horses to be the face of your brand in public? The last thing you would want is a violent and aggressive horse meeting a potential customer. Number 4. Shetland Pony Shetland ponies have been teaching people how to ride a horse for years now, including a young Queen Elizabeth, for that matter. However, before their relatively tame lives they live nowadays, they were made to work hard back in the days before tractors. Thanks to their small height, Shetland ponies were used in place of children down in the mines, with them spending two weeks underground and two weeks above at a time. While this might seem cruel, apparently the ponies were treated better than the human miners. Strong, intelligent, yet gentle, you'd be forgiven for not thinking these diminutive beasts were that powerful. 
Looks like Batman's leading the charge there. <laughs> However, pound for pound, they are the strongest of the horse family, with their thunderous legs able to pull more than double their own body weight, making them twice as strong as most heavy horses. Small really is mighty, then. Found in the Scottish Shetland Islands, the heritage of these animals stretches all the way back to the Viking times where they were brought across the sea by these villaging people. So while they might look sweet and like a pocket-sized horse, I wouldn't underestimate these 40-inch high animals. Number 3. American Quarter the American Quarter Horse is one of the oldest breeds of horse in North America, and also one of the most popular. It's quite easy to see why this breed of horse would be so popular, it has enough positive attributes for multiple breeds. This long list includes being gentle in nature, versatile, beautiful, fast as anything, and intensely loyal. Sounds like someone really hit the jean jackpot, if you ask me. If it was a human, it would definitely be prom king or queen. There's no point having these great qualities if no one can ride you, however. So thankfully, the quarter horse breed is suitable for all levels of riders and owners, as they conveniently tend to be friendly with people and are insanely easy to train. With a strong and sturdy physique, they usually come in brownie red, or for the sophisticated amongst us, sorrel. Their work CV includes a history of working as ranch horses, race horses, and even playing the family pet. Sounds like the quarter horse really has it all. Number 2. Thoroughbred Horse a thoroughbred horse is not everyone's cup of tea, to say the least. While you probably know of the name through its horse racing abilities, the thoroughbred horse is actually full of multiple talents which are outside of the racing circuit. This multi-purpose horse and its riders usually end up sliding into a second career after retirement as riding or driving horses and also have an average life expectancy of 25. We all lose our temper from time to time, but the thoroughbred does more than most. Dubbed as a hot-blooded horse, this basically means that the thoroughbred horse is seen as spirited, bold, intelligent, and athletic. While this makes it never boring to look after due to the constant threat of a bite, it does mean that not every equestrian has the capabilities to handle one. Regardless of their lack of keeping cool, they are magnificent beasts. Thoroughbreds also hold the most world records of any breed of horse. This includes the fastest speed achieved by a horse at 43.97 miles per hour, most expensive with a price tag of 16 million bucks, and smartest with most numbers correctly identified by a horse in one minute, 19. Number 1. Morgan Horse it sounds pretty ominous when you hear that this next horse is known as the horse that chooses you. Everyone knows what a people pleaser is, and there's not a breed of horse that fits that description like the Morgan horse. Exceptionally cooperative and with an incomparable eagerness to please humans, the Morgan horse is one horse you would love to have around. Easy to keep and suitable for equestrians of all levels, the Morgan horse is even suitable for children to ride. Aside from being the type of horse you would love to bring over for a dinner with the family. The Morgan Horse also boasts as being one of the most elegant and versatile breeds in the world. Its talent apparently knows no bounds, with Morgans competing in everything from roping to dressage and every sport in between. Their strength and stamina are renowned, but so are their good disposition and intelligence. Sounds like the full package. The world of horse breeds is truly a varied world, but if you had to choose one to own, which would it be? Also, check out our other cool stuff showing up on screen right now. See you next time!